Okay, um, scatter plots. We can't use 2,000 as, 20,000 as our um, y intercept, so we have to use point slope here because we're not sure if it is. So you have to use point slope. And um, they want it in standard form because they want it in standard form. You solve for y, like find slope like we do. Solve for y. And then um, and then um, make move. If you solve for y, you get this, right? And then you have to move the x over to the other side for slope um, for standard form. So you would minus add 15x to both sides to get the answer. Okay. And then median median cost. Here's the cost starting from the lowest point, and our lowest point is this point. Do not use um, points you created on the graph. Only the existing point there. Okay, that, and then 8 next, 10 next, 12 next. Make sure you include the, um, make sure you include the outlier, and there's two 1400s, and then find the middle number, okay? Um, make sure you don't forget the outlier. It includes that in there, too. Okay, um, these things will be on tomorrow's test, so make sure you know Mondays, so making it in standard form is very important. Make sure you know how to do that. Um, this stuff will be on there. Um, factoring, make sure you know how to do that. Make sure that um, I was looking at your homework and some students are leaving um, 12y squared I'm number seven. Um, you can do number one through five on here, right? Um, no, not enough room. So just do it at the bottom here. I'm going to do number seven because most of you know how to do this. You need to distribute first, right, and then combine like terms. Um, on a lot of them. Minus, make sure you distribute the negative. Okay, to all of them, and then you add the two together. Okay, make sure you remember that for your test on Monday. When you're factoring, if it says factoring, you can divide all these by two. So your answer for number seven is um, two. You factor out. What's left is six y squared minus five. Factor out on all this is six. Uh, v squared, so your answer is 6v parentheses, um, 3v to the second, um, oh no, 6 does not go into 27, 3, so 3v, that gives us 6 here, v squared, plus 9 um, V plus huh, 9 9 can go into all of them the reason why I know can I only get this I get 12 and I can factor out another 3 so 9, 3 times the 3 is 9. Okay. Notice how I did that incorrectly. 2, 3, and then 4. And that's your answer right there. This is the work I need to see, I guess. Here we can factor out 5 and t, and your answer is 5t parentheses, 1t to the fourth power plus invisible 1, 
to the fifth power. That makes six. Okay, plus five t squared minus two. And that's your answer right there. Um, this you can factor um, 6m squared. All right, let's do the highest exponent first, which is this one. So you're factoring out a 6m squared. That will get us um, m to the 6 for this one. And then the next one is this one right here. So plus 6m squared. And the last one is this one. That's plus 2. Okay, and that's your answer. All right, and make sure you do that correctly. And then this one here, um, for those who are absent, the easiest way to do this is add these together. You get 2x plus 1. Remember, when you add, you just add the coefficient, the leading coefficient, not the exponent. Now, when you multiply, like here, when you're multiplying, that's when you add the exponent of 2. Okay, notice the difference. So, um, when we're multiplying, like this one, that's when it becomes um, w squared. Okay, so, but when you're adding like this, you're not multiplying, you just add the coefficients to get 2. And then plus 1 for that one. And then on this one, you add, 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 add. You get x to the 4th. x plus 4, I mean. And you multiply that with 2x plus 1 with this problem here. And then you can solve it by that you get um, x to the 3rd power, um, 2x to the I mean, 2x to the second power plus an x plus 8x, because this times this, plus the 4. And then you combine the ones that are alike here, and you get 2x squared plus um, 9x plus 4. Let's cross that out. 2x, okay, cross that out. And then you do the same for this one, okay? This one may have room on the side here for you to multiply or do in the square, it doesn't matter. But here at least I need to show uh, one step here, c squared plus 9c plus 2c plus the 18. And then we know that the answer, then you can find the answer, c squared plus 11 plus 18, you cross that out. Okay, you can do that. I need to see one steps on all these where it says mental. And you do, yes, you need to do down here. Read the direction on what to do on that one. Okay, and that's your homework for today. Make sure you study all the stuff that I said that will be on the test, which is on 